Hey everyone, this is Jackie Bolin coming to you from Busan, South Korea. I'm the author of the book, How to Get a University Job in South Korea, which is available on Amazon. Uh, today I'm going to talk about the basic requirements that you have to meet in order to get a uni job in Korea. I'm not talking about things like education or experience, uh, like as it relates to a master's degree or how many years experience you have teaching adults or something like that. But these are just the basic requirements set by the Korean government in order to either get an E2 visa, which is a conversation visa, or an E1 visa, which is a professor visa. So the first requirement is that you need to be from one of seven countries, or hold a passport from one of those countries, I should say. So the countries are Canada, England, uh, the US, Australia, New Zealand, Ireland, and which one did I miss? Uh, South Africa, I think is the last one. Uh, the second thing is that you need a clean criminal record check. There are no exceptions to this. You have to submit a criminal record check before you get your visa, and even a minor offense on your record probably will not be accepted by Korean immigration. Uh, the next thing is a health check. So you have to get a health check done when you first get to Korea, and I think you might need to get one done before you leave your home country, but I'm not totally sure about this, but I know for sure, for certain, that you will need to get one in your first maybe month in Korea. So uh, the rules change all the time, but it often includes an AIDS test and it often includes a drug test, even for things like marijuana. So if you have either of those things, if you take drugs regularly and it's still in your system, that could be a big problem. Or if you have AIDS, that could also be a big, big problem for you. And I don't actually recommend coming to Korea in either of those cases because Korea is not a friendly place for those things. So uh, the next thing you need to think about is getting the timing right. So if you want a university job, you need to start at certain times of the year. So the semesters start, the main one starts in March, and then the second, uh, the spring semester, or sorry, the fall semester starts in September. So you need to be applying for uni jobs maybe three months is kind of the prime time before either September or March. If your timing is not right, there isn't much you can do about that, unfortunately. And the final requirement that you need to think about is, of course, a bachelor's degree. A bachelor's degree in anything is a requirement set by the Korean government before they'll give you a visa. So good luck in finding a, finding a university job in South Korea. If you need more information about how to do that, you can go to my website, My Life Teaching in a Korean University, at uh, eslteacherinkorea.blogspot.com, and also check out my book on Amazon, How to Get a University Job in South Korea. I'll put the links to both those things in the notes below the video. Take care.